Water resources are becoming a problem in Tunisia. Experts say the state needs to implement modern technology to ensure sustainable supplies. CGTN's Adam Chouachi takes a look at some of the options on the table. For the third consecutive year, Tunisia suffers from a water deficit estimated to 164 million cubic meters. Water results in various dams of the country reached 1,056 million cubic meters, that is 50% of the reception capacity of these structures. Most areas of the country suffered from a deficit in rainfall, despite the slight improvement recorded, especially over the past three months. The use of smart waters is one of the solutions to cope with the scarcity of water in Tunisia according to the results of the first phase of a study conducted by the Tunisian Institute for Strategic Studies. Smart water technologies enable the management of water resources through the satellite-related digital equipment to promote instant registration of these resources in Tunisia. Geological researchers emphasize the need to implement the National Water Technology Development Program by moving towards the use of non-conventional resources, such as treated water, giving their availability. The weakness of surface water resources that evaporate with the effect of rising temperatures and the increase in the salinity of water in dams and hill lakes are the main problems. The increase in groundwater salinity, 2.1 billion cubic meters, is a hindrance. Desalination of seawater could be an alternative. Experts assert that the flow of large wadis in Tunisia is threatened by the construction of dams. The increase in water pressure and demand from 1870 million cubic meters in 1990 to 2700 million cubic meters in 2016, reaching 2770 million cubic meters in 2030. Geological researchers now speak of the possibility of installing a modern equipment in dams, distribution and irrigation channels and household meters to collect the necessary data, detect failures and intervene to solve problems related to flow, theft of irrigation water and loss of water in the canals. Adventure with CGTN, Tunis.